How's it going, everybody? Doing a uh, birthday pickups <laughs> video here today. These are the things I got for my birthday. It was on the first. Figure I'd throw it up. Uh, this stuff is pretty much all from my. Actually, it is all for my girlfriend. I'd gotten money sent to me from my mom and dad and stuff like that, and my grandma and aunts, uncles. And I got a few T-shirts. But uh, first thing she got me was the latest Witcher book released here. This came out in '97 in Poland, and it's been released uh, everywhere else over the years. They finally started releasing these books, I guess, maybe like three or four years ago, or maybe even maybe like five years ago, uh, over here, which I'm glad they have, because these books are phenomenal. I love them. I've read all the other ones so far that I've been able to. And uh, there's one more after this. I think there's another, like, story, you know, uh, broken up story, one that has, like, separate stories in it. But these, uh, the, these four here and then the one after are all part of, like, the big series. And the other ones are just, like, adventures <clears throat> that he's gone on. Like short little short stories, but uh, it's, I've read the first chapter so far. It's cool. These books are great. It's some of the best fantasy stuff I've ever read. The games are awesome too. That's why I found out about these from the games. Was obviously, the games are based off these books. They take place after I think the last one. <clears throat> but really good stuff. Tower Tower of Swallows. This one is. Uh, if you're into fantasy stuff, read these books because they're fucking awesome. <clears throat> uh, got a ten dollar eShop card here which I've used on this, the Nintendo 2DS. I've been on and off wanting this thing for like two years, and uh, she got it for me. I didn't expect it, and I'm, I'm glad she did get it because I've been fucking enjoying the hell out of this thing. Came with Mario Kart 7. This thing's cheap now, too. It's like 80 bucks for the bundle. Came with Mario Kart 7 download code. Here's the uh, system. She got me a case for it. Here's the system. Great, fucking feels great, man. This actually feels like well built. Like seeing this in videos and stuff, in pictures, you feel it'd be a little flimsy, but man, it it feels great in my hands. It's a great, great fit for my hands. And uh, that sounded a bit uh, perverted, but <laughs> it was not meant to be. But a uh, really cool system. Been enjoying the hell out of it so far. And I got a, my her mother got me a twenty five dollar GameStop card, and I picked up Theater Rhythm. Final Fantasy was one of the games I got here. This game's awesome. It's a rhythm game, obviously, where you like tap on the screen and you like drag and stuff like that. And uh, you play. You can play through the first 13 games, and uh, it, it's cool. Well, I played through the first two. I'm on the third one now. You set first. You got to select your characters from characters throughout the series. I've got Lightning from 13, Cecil from four, which was two here. Um, like the Warrior of Light or something from the first one, I believe, or the second one, and uh, Titus from 10. <clears throat> but it's cool. It's got actually a pretty cool art style. They kind of look like almost like dolls <laughs> a little bit, but I kind of like it. Uh, it's cool. You go through like a, an overworld scene. You got the prelude in the epilogue. You got the overworld scene where you're walking, and uh, you have like a battle scene and then a boss thing. It's, it's really cool. Like I said, you play through a bunch of them. I'm on three now. It's a really a lot of fun. I'm enjoying the hell out of it. It actually was complete too, which is crazy. From GameStop, it's only seven bucks too, so totally worth it. I know there's another one, Curtain Call. I don't know which one's on that, but if it's a, if it's got a decent amount of other stuff, I may pick it up. But it may just have like this and plus downloadable songs. And the other game I got was Legend of Zelda: Ocarina of Time 3D. Obviously, a remake of the classic on the Nintendo 64. Put it in ten minutes. Of, ten played about ten minutes of it so far, and the freaking nostalgia just like poured over me. It was nuts. I loved this game when it came out, man. I freaking got it. It was probably like a sixty or seventy dollar game when it came out. You know, back when Nintendo sixty four games were still selling like you know old Genesis and Super Nintendo games. You pick up some would be like seventy dollars. I mean, my friend and I got Road Rash and Nintendo sixty four. We split it. It was a seventy dollar game. But this might have been like sixty bucks when it came out. Maybe it was fifty. I don't know. I can't remember. But uh, it, it's, it's, you know, it, it, just, it was a phenomenal game. I know they did updated stuff. It looks great graphically. They did a good job of that. And uh, I can't wait to put more time into this because it's just going to, the nostalgia is going to be a freaking almost overwhelming. Because <laughs> I really, I should have been in my list of top five nostalgia games, actually. <clears throat> I'm glad to have these two. And there's a bunch more I want for this thing. Like, I enjoy the Vita, but I, there's more games I want for the, this system, the 2DS. A lot more. <clears throat> so, and there's some good ones coming out. I got a Corpse Party now coming out, a, a remake of the original Corpse Party that came out 
I had that downloaded for the PSP that's on the Vita, but uh, I'll pick that up again. Fuck it. <laughs> uh, they have some pretty cool games coming out. So uh, that's the stuff that I got. That and the book, and the system here. But just real quickly, wanted to show that stuff. Thanks everybody for checking it out, and have a good day.